Diaz. Mike Diaz has done it. What a capstone he puts on the trilogy here tonight. After that impressive win, Diaz would take his ball and go home. Citing inactivity, the UFC would remove him from their rankings, and Dana White went so far as to question the Stockton native's value to the company. The kid makes good money. The kid makes really good money, you know? And the unfortunate part is he's not a needle mover. After months of posturing, the two sides finally came to terms, with Diaz being given a co-main event slot on Fox against the number three ranked lightweight fighter in the world. Rafael Dos Anjos is coming into this one riding a two-fight knockout streak. The first came against Jason High in June. Oh, drops in there. And in August, he took out former champion Benson Henderson. Oh, no, Henderson. Oh, Having a definite wrestling advantage, Dos Anjos will decide where this one takes place. And with his improved striking, he may choose to battle the Caesar Gracie black belt on the feet. For Diaz to pick up the win, He'll need to do what the Diaz brothers do, wear out his opponent with relentless boxing pressure, and if it hits the mat, look for submissions off his back. Can Diaz get the win and increase his value, or will Dos Anjos send him back to Stockton?